Today was a uh, shopping day. We went to Dollar Tree, Walmart, and Grocery Outlet to stock up on groceries since our main shopping area is a good 30, 40 minutes away from us. Um, I'll give you a little taste of, of uh, my haul there. Some snacks, some baking, some household stuff, some cooking. <laughs> First, let's start with Dollar Tree. We were really happy to see that the Dollar Tree was so well stocked. Uh, usually when we go there, it's not well stocked at all. I think the cashier said they only get it once a week, get restocked once a week, So, and it happened to be that day. So um, here's some of the things I found. I always buy plastic sandwich bags and, and um, storage bags at Dollar Tree because they're just so cheap. This is a, they have two different types of um, sandwich bags, one type with the, the slide and the other type with the, uh, the fold over. The fold over is 125 to a package and the slide is 40 to a package. Sometimes you need a slide closure, but often I don't. I try not to use plastic bags too often. I don't find them um, real ecological, but sometimes you do need them. So uh, I get these for that those times. <laughs> so they happen to have the ones, the fold over ones for a dollar. So I pick those up. I also love these containers, these flat containers. I find them so convenient and so easy to stack. You can see what's in them. Um, they're probably my number one favorite. So I also saw these, I've seen them there before, but this time I picked up five sets of them. They're these sort of flannelly type things. They go in the ad, it goes, or the, the package, it goes between pots and pans, but I'm gonna use them between my uh, casserole dishes and my corningware dishes, because right now I just have paper towels between them and it just gets really messy. So as I say, I got five of these. Um, to use in the kitchen, in the pantry area, dishes, storage area. <laughs> I also was delighted to see that they had these mini mini cupcake things. The price is about comparable to Walmart's, a uh, dollar for a hundred, and I think it's like three dollars for three hundred at Walmart. But what I like is they have the different colors. They have the plain white, and then these are look like they're purple, either purple and red or plain purple. I'm not quite sure. But when I make uh, brownie bites, I make sometimes two or three different flavors out of the same box. So I was putting them in separate like plastic containers to store them, but this will be great. If I want to make a mixed platter or something, I can um, immediately identify which type uh, they are by the different color um, little muffin muffin cups on them. I also picked up these um, muffin uh, liners. I love to use these. Uh, they're great. They make cleanup really easy and storage and all that of muffins or cupcakes. Uh, there's 90 to a package uh, for a dollar. I noticed Dollar Tree also has ones that are 100 to a package. In uh, these were in the food area by the baking um, baking goods, and then the 100 to a package was in the um, like cooking area where you can get the spoons and the silverware and all that. But those other ones, 100, seem to be smaller. I held these up to the other ones, and they were just smaller in size. So I'm not sure what that's all about. <laughs> Also got a microwave cover for my microwave, so I don't have to put a paper towel or anything on top of on top of it. I do have a very small microwave, so I'm gonna have to check if this actually fits. They had um, canned asparagus beers, so I got some of those to put in uh, my salads. I really love these. They uh, brown rice cakes with Himalayan salt. They look like they're really healthy, though I am almost willing to bet you they are not healthy. But they are really good, <laughs> so I got a pack of those for a dollar. Also, they had this. I haven't tried it. It's uh, bourbon chicken McCormick, like a simmer sauce. Probably be good in the crock pot. I don't know what the deal is, but I bought one of them. I'm gonna give it a try. And finally, I love these. Um, I love their chewy fudge, uh, Duncan Hines um, brownie mixes that come in from time to time. They're 18, I think they're almost 18 ounces, something like that. And so what I did a week ago is I took one of these and um, I made uh, three different types of, uh, of brownie bites with them using this, the muffin, the little muffin pan, the little tiny um, muffin um, cupcake liners like I showed you earlier. And with the with the additives, you know, I made three different types. It made like 60, um, 60 little, little muffin bites it was our uh, brownie bites it was really great so i got another one of these and i'll show you how i i got 60 brownie bites out of it <laughs> i did cheat and went to a grocery outlet where i got two boxes of a uh, jiffy corn mix this was 57 cents a box and i thought i'd hit the jackpot and then i went to walmart and saw they were actually uh, 47 cents at, at walmart so 
if you're you know pinching pennies or whatever and, and you or you need to buy a, a bunch be sure to check you know walmart's price also for these and at grocery outlet i got these um espresso like chocolate chips and um i thought that'd be fun when i make my brownie bites for christmas or whatever to um have some with this this coffee flavoring in them so that was my my haul uh today at dollar tree i'm i'm real happy with it i was especially happy that they were stocked because it made things a lot easier <laughs> anyway happy shopping and um happy fourth of july <laughs>